Hello everybody, time for me to do a VHS DVD update for April 1st, 2019, aka April Fools. Like yeah, I always do update videos for April Fools, like which was for April 1st, like which was since two years ago, like which was 2017, and then last year, 2018, and for now, 2019, like which I don't know why, but oh well. Okay, so anyways, for the update, I'm going to show you a total of 6 BHSs and 5 DVDs. Yesterday, I was in out of town, and I went to Valley Village and Vaughn Highway 7, and I picked up 5 features tapes and 5 DVDs. And today, I've just received a VHS tape from eBay. So, we're bound to begin. So, first up... The five VHS tapes I got from Valley Village and Vaughn Highway 7 yesterday. So here we go. So this first one I already do have, but I have to get another copy to this tape. I'm going to explain to you why in a minute. This is another one of the two Boston VHS of Stuart Little, 999 movie. From the co-director of The Lion King, the little family just got bigger. A family adventure filled with the excitement, fun, and one absolutely adorable mouse is George Peninacchio, APCTB, with a PG, and it's 85 minutes. This and not a new copy is, however, have a dark light stick label on it, like which was pretty nice. It was it was printed on March 11th, 2000. Now, um, as y'all may notice, I already have this. I have this for quite some time. This is in the hard climb show, as you can see. This copy is in a softer clamp shell, but this one's in a hard climb shell. It has an ink label on it. This one has a stick label on it, like I said. It was originally printed on August 5th, 2000. Unfortunately, throughout the whole tape, it was damaged and sun faded, but although the film strip is fine, as you can see, yep, the film strip is fine, but however, it was damaged and sun faded throughout the whole tape. Really badly sun faded throughout the whole tape and damaged. I was unable to watch this one, so that's the main reason why I bought another copy like to this tape as you can see. So also for this copy, I'm definitely like gonna have to throw it away after the video. But also for this new copy, I've just tested out this tape and it plays really great. No damages whatsoever. So yes, this VHS does play great, so I'm definitely going to have to keep this as a new copy. So yeah. Alright. Now next, the 1989 features of Battle of Britain, a Harry Saltzman production, MGA UA home video title. The greatest aerial spectacle says Hollywood Reporter. British G and it's 2 hours and 13 minutes. I have to rewind this tape yesterday. Print date 286 day of 1988. Even though this is really from 1989. So it's it. So it's an early print. Alright, and now for the next three tapes. These next three, I already bought the brand new, but it's already been opened up by camera as you can see. But really, I bought these three tapes, like which are brand new sealed, and I already opened up by camera yesterday. So yeah. 
So next, the 1999 features of Strange Brew, 1983 movie from Dave Thomas, Rick Morians, and Paul Dooley, and Max von Steydorp. And this is a MGM movie time tape. Yeah, I've been wanting to see this movie, so I get this. And I placed this sticker on the case you can see. Yeah, that's how you can tell like, that I really got this copy brand new. Along with these next two tapes. So, yeah. Funny Wild Hyperactive. A fresh breath from north of the border, says the New York Post. Ready PG, and it's 1 hour and 41 minutes. It came with this insert. I'll show you that after the tape. After the actual tape, I meant. And now for the sticker label, it kind of make you think like it's the Nantai Free VHS. But if you could take a look over here, so you could see it's a reprint. Prints on June 3rd, 1999. June 3rd, 1999. Like, yep, this is still the 1999 VHS. You could see. Alright, and now for the insert. Just don't want to let that fall in that case. Here. For all of these movies, I have not got them yet. No, I haven't, but hopefully I might will soon. Okay, next, two busted one features of IMAX Blue Planet 1990 movie. Yeah, I do like IMAX, so I have to get this. A road view like no other, not rated 42 minutes. And now normally I got this copy brand new already, but however, when I pop out the tape, it was not rewinded yet. You're like, yeah, I got it brand new, but it was not rewinded. Maybe it's because of the shrink wrap, like who got ruined already. So yeah. So I have to rewind it. February 26, 2004, a late reprint. Here's the last tape, like which I bought it brand new, and the last tape I got from Vi Village and Fawn Highway 7 yesterday. The 2002 B Chest of the Salt and Sea, 2001 movie from Fison D. Arneo Frail, Doug Hudson. And Val Kimmer and Peter Scar Scott. The sticker thing for free ninety nine. If you're looking for the truth, you've come to the wrong place. Tricky film Neuer, a cool groove of the movie says Peter travels Rolling Stone. Rated R for strong, violent, drug use, language, and some sexuality, 103 minutes. August 15th, 2002, and August 20th, 2002. Five days apart. Okay, and now next up, the features tape I got from eBay today. I have two attempts failed to get and keep this tape. Because back in July 22nd of last year, I did get this copy brand new. But however, it got mold everywhere on the videotape. And then second, back in January 13th of this year, 
I did get another copy of this tape and I was pleased because there was no mold but I was not pleased because it was damaged like throughout the whole tape so I ended up throwing like this tape once again so I have to order this tape which that's the main reason why because I have trouble finding this tape at trip stores so that's the main reason why I ordered this one from eBay and I'm like going to reveal it to you in a second. So it's the another one of the Tsubasa 4 features of Color to Realp Tsubasa 4 movie from Tom Cruise and Jamie Foxx. And this is a former rental from Hollywood Video as you can see. And I cannot remember this credit review like what it says right there so I can't read it unfortunately like yeah this tape is a former rental from hollywood video like i said and i might just read everything from the case again even though i already read it from july 22nd of last year but i might read it again a wild ride says owen goldberman entertainment weekly tom cruise unplugged says joel sigel good morning america Rated R for violence and language, and it is two hours. This is a DreamWorks Pictures, co-produced by Paramount Pictures. See, Hollywood video. And this copy is rare, because as you can see, it's got black wheels. Unlike most copies to this tape, it had white wheels, but this copy is rare in the wheel prints, because it's got black wheels, so... That's the main reason why I ordered this tape as you can see. And as you can see also on the label and on the case, it has a name like which was Hayes, like who used to own this tape. But this tape is now mine. And yes, there was usually a Hollywood video and label, but I peeled it off to see what the print date was. It was printed on November 11th, 2004. And this one I also have to rewind. And once after I did, I've checked and tested out this tape. And guess what But the good news is? Lo and behold, this play a whole lot better than two attempts failed I have. Yeah, it took me a whole lot of time to get another copy of this tape. Because I've been wanting to see this movie. And I couldn't get a chance to watch this movie since first it had mold and then second damaged throughout the whole tape. Yeah, this is the movie like which I've been wanting to see right now, so that's the main reason why I ordered this tape. And like I said, I've just tested out this tape, and yes, this copy plays a whole lot better. So since this copy plays a whole lot better, I'm definitely gonna have to keep this tape this time from now on. So yes, this time, I'm gonna have to keep like this copy since it played a whole lot better. And if you can take a look at this, as you can see, yeah, I actually didn't end up taking up the lid, as you can see, because normally when I got this tape from eBay today, the lid came a little bit broken, so I have to repair it with this tape. But like I said, this copy plays a whole lot better, like, throughout the whole tape, so I'm definitely gonna have to keep this copy from now on, since it played a whole lot better. So yeah, finally got my chance to watch this movie. I will definitely watch this movie after I'm done in this video. Okay, and now that is it like for the VHS tapes and now for the five DVDs. These were all the five DVDs I got from Vi Village yesterday. So these first four DVDs like which I'm about to go and show you right now. These first four are Thomas and Friends DVDs. And I finally just got in time to increase them from my collection. Yeah, I always got a lot of Thomas and Friends stuff. For my collection for the whole all the time haven't I? so this first one this is the first ever thomas and friends dvd to be released it the two busted one dvd of thomas and friends the best of thomas the collector's edition i have this one on vhs and i do remember it years ago i rented this dvd from blockbuster video and now i finally got my new old copy of it Here's the episodes, pause the video and read, I don't feel like want to, and as a matter of fact, I'm never going to read the episodes like for these four Thomas and Friends DVDs, nothing at all, and here's the bonus features like which I'm also not going to read, 
The running time is 46 minutes, and due to the fact that these four Thomas and Friends DVDs, like which I'm about to go and show you right now, these four are not braided. Here's the DVD. I have to refurbish this one, unfortunately. So, so, hold on, I can make this. Hold on a second, everybody. I apologize for the distraction about this everybody because my dad has really just started to call me right now So yeah, I apologize for that distraction So anyways, here's like what the disc looks like like which I already refurbished Yep, this is a DVD like which I have to refurbish Okay next from 2004, even though the case is 2003, but this DVD and like including like the features like for this video really came out in 2004. Best of Gordon, also collector's editions. This is another one like which I also have on VHS and I also do remember renting this DVD from Blockbuster video years ago. So yeah, here's the episodes and the bonus features. 46 minutes Here's the DVD. I have to refurbish this one So you can see And now normally um when I got this DVD um the snap thingy like for this one like it came off and like and it got broken and like the casing like for this DVD like it was actually broken and not in the best of shape so in order for me to do it well, remember that spare copy of Home for the Holidays, that DVD, like which I already still have? Well, back in December of 2018, I really didn't know if I have two spare DVD copies of Home for the Holidays until for now. So, I really didn't want to keep that two spare copies of Home for the Holidays DVD. So, this casing, like, was from... Home for the Holidays DVD, like which I put this cover like into this case and I put the actual disc in. So yeah, for the entire copy of Home for the Holidays DVD, I'm not going to keep it so I'm going to have to donate it or throw it out. But for the first copy, Home of the Holidays, like that the one that says 2009 on it on the back of the case, I'm still going to keep this one like which I already still have it, like which happens to be right here and just in that case if y'all don't believe me um like yep yeah, this is the dvd like which i'm still going to keep i just didn't know if i had two copies like of this dvd so i replaced one of them like into by putting the cover art of the best of gordon like into like this dvd case and like including the disc so yes, this is the only DVD like which I'm still gonna have to keep like not the spare one I'm not going to keep these two copies like of this DVD anymore So I'm gonna have to throw it or donate the another one while well, I'm still going to keep this one from now on So yes, this is the one like which I'm still gonna have to keep from now on so Maybe I could put this back in Right And now like like yeah, I put the cover like into like the actual DVD case and like including the disc. Yep, including the disc as you, as you can see, including the disc. Alright, and now anyways, on to our next DVD, like which was from 2004. Thomas and Friends, Thomas and his friends get along. I remembered renting the VHS version of this from which when wait which one? No, I remembered renting the VHS version of this from Aurora Public Library years ago, like which I did not have this VHS yet, but I'm gonna have to get it like sometime sooner or later. Here's the episodes and the bonus features. This is 56 minutes. Here's the disc, and now normally I've could have sworn like on the on the back of the disc, like there is like a little bit of bunch of fingerprints on it, so I used to spray and I keep on trying it, but it doesn't seem to be working at all, so I refurbished it. Sick and see, because normally there are a little bit of surface scratches everywhere, so I have to refurbish it. But 
But don't worry, that spray thing for the GFG Easy Pro like still works, but just accept this one. It didn't really work out that well, so I used the, the machine to fix this. <laughs> right? And now anyways... For this video, um, the two features copies, um, the first one, it was originally released in 1998, and then the second features copy, it was re-released in 2000, and then, then, and then this DVD, it came out in 2004, and then later on, Lionsgate did a reprint to this DVD. So yeah, but I like the original copy of this DVD rather than Lionsgate because like I said, I do not like hit entertainment DVDs like along with the Lions Gate reprint. So I'm sticking like into the original copy of this DVD. Alright, last Thomas and Friends DVD for the update. From Tip Us at 7, a big day for Thomas. I have this one on VHS, like which from Tip Us and Free, Hit Entertainment, and I do remember renting the DVD version of this. From Richmond Hill Public Library, either back to bus and seven. Here's the episodes and the bonus features. Thirty-nine minutes. DVD. I have to refurbish this one. Okay. Alright, and now for the one and only DVD like which from Blue's Room and this is the last DVD for the update. This is from Tip Us at 7 also and it's Blue's Room Nights of the Snack Table. Here's the special features like for this DVD is Wonder Pet Sneak Peek. The episodes from Blue's Room are Night of the Snack Table and Blue's Farm Playdate. And the two bonus episodes from Blue's Clues is The Boat Float and The Scavenger Hunt. Not rated 100 minutes. Here's the DVD. I have to refurbish this one. Alright, and now that is it like for this VHS DVD update for April 1st, 2019 done. So I hope y'all enjoying pranking someone for April Fools for today. So that's it. I will see you all later everybody. Hey, happy April Fools Day.